What's up, Madden 16 fans, guys? Welcome to the Mutt Budget Card of the Week, guys. This is where we show you a card that's easy to get in Madden Ultimate Team, uh, something that's really easy to afford, uh, but also something that's really effective. Now, uh, what better place to start an uh, offense than a quarterback? Uh, you need a quarterback to be effective in this year's game. But I'm going to contend that you don't need those top-tier elite passers. And uh, what I want to show you is a couple quarterbacks that I have. Uh, this is my budget item of the week, and it's on my team. I've been playing with him all week long. I think he's one of the better uh, budget items in the, real, in the whole game, uh, for that matter. But he's a he's a very very low rated actually. Uh, but let me just show you this guy. His name is Grayson, and in my opinion, he is one of the most underrated mutt items um, in the game, uh, especially as a starter item. Uh, if you don't have a lot of coins and you're looking to get a quarterback, you can get him for about 600 coins. Let me just show you some of his statistics here. Um, and I actually got him for a lot cheaper than this. I got him for about 100 coins. But look at this guy, uh, statistics here. He's got 81 speed, which is really good. He's got some mobility. He's got almost 90 throwing power, which in my opinion, you know, enough throwing power to get the job done, especially for your starter games. And then he's got about 80 short accuracy and 82 deep accuracy. I don't really throw medium uh, very much, so I don't really worry about that. I kind of focus on the deep throw accuracy and the short throw accuracy. And there you see uh, Grayson does a really nice job. Um, and so I just want to recommend him, uh, and then now I want to compare his uh, statistics uh, with that of one of the, you know, one of the higher overall quarterbacks. You know, somebody might be in the 80s, and uh, we'll show you some of these guys right now. Uh, we just wanted to show just a couple of examples of, of how he's actually, a, you know, a fairly comparable option uh, to some of these quarterbacks. And let's show you by uh, formation here, and we'll show you uh, these quarterbacks. But uh, like I said, he's you know kind of close to the kind of the 81 overall tier. And uh, let me just show you, he may not quite be as as good as these guys are, um, as you see they're they're throwing stats. But here he's got actually you know the same throwing power as Eli Manning. Uh, not quite as good middle accuracy and short accuracy, but better deep accuracy and a lot more speed. So I believe the advantage goes to you know, goes to my guy Grayson in that ad avenue. Stafford, we all know he's probably going to have really good throwing power. So we're not going to be able to really compare here. His his stats are really good. He's a great passer. Um, but maybe one of those guys, and, and like I said, you know, he may not be able to kind of beat out the 80 to 84 top tier guys. Um, like I said, we don't really have a ton of options here, um, you know, as far as these really, really elite quarterbacks. But if you look at that next tier, kind of those guys that you're going to spend some coin on, um, you know, to really kind of get started, and uh, he should save you some coin. Uh, we'll, let me compare him here to Alex Smith. Um, you know, and, and Alex Smith here has terrible deep accuracy as you see there and five points lower in that category uh, he has a little more accuracy short throw but not quite as much here Teddy Bridgewater a guy that you're gonna spend 12,000 coins on um, you see that my guy is a little bit better he's got the same deep accuracy a little more speed a little more throw power um, and so in my opinion just a better overall player uh, we'll show you here Carson Palmer um, this is just a guy like I said he's a starting guy but he's very serviceable in my opinion here he has better accuracy deep than Carson Palmer better throw power than Carson Palmer and better sh uh, speed than Carson Palmer so just my opinion guys I think he's a really good budget item uh, the main card I'm gonna show off here is the RG3 card um, you see that RG3 doesn't have really that good of middle accuracy or deep throw accuracy he does have that 90 speed but in my opinion the speed category really doesn't matter as much this season uh, as long as you have 80 and up and so I really you know don't worry as much about that like here we'll show you Colin Kaepernick um, you know his stats, accuracy stats are really not very good, and you see that again. My quarterback, little Grayson, uh, with that 89 throw power and 80 throw short, 82 throw deep, is really just, in my opinion, a really effective budget item uh, for you guys. And then you know we can probably show it best here in like the cases of Nick Foles and Ryan Fitzpatrick. But um, Foles really isn't that bad. But like I said, no deep accuracy. So just wanted to kind of show you guys. Just wanted to give you guys a quick little glimpse here. Into, the, into some of the things you can look at in Madden Ultimate Team here. Look at Marcus Mariotti. He's got some really nice stats here. Um, not really a good deep accuracy quarterback, but like I said, these are your guys that are going to cost you about 15,000 coins. Um, and, the, and like I said, you know, he may not be better than those guys, but he is very close um, to, to being almost, almost in their category. Um, you know, in my opinion, like I said, I just feel like he is a, a very effective quarterback for you. If you're looking to get started, um, let me see what team he's on here for you guys real quick. I think if I remember correctly, um, like I said, you can just put his name in there and it should come up. Um, but let's see if we can find him more on the auction block. Uh, my man Grayson looks like there was only a couple cards left out there. I mean, he's a rare card, um, so you may need to kind of do some searching. Uh, and then let me give you one other little bonus uh, budget item here this week. And this is one that we probably, and you see here is Grayson. Uh, I think he's a free agent or something like that, but I'm, or no, he's New Orleans Saints. But um, 
you know, I really like this card, and and I and I don't know if he's the best uh, quarterback, uh, you know, in this echelon, but I think he's the best for me, and uh, and so that's why I really wanted to kind of show it off. Like I said, 600 coins. I mean, you can't really be mad at that. Uh, you know, you get a nice quarterback that can kind of get you up to the that top level and really get you kind of started. Um, and then real quick, I wanted to to kind of show off one other card here, one other quarterback card. Um, if I could find him, he plays for the Arizona Cardinals. We saw him here. And uh, I really, really enjoy using uh, this Logan Thomas card. And he's not really a great overall, but in my opinion, he's just a really good quarterback uh, and someone that is really serviceable for your team if you're looking for one of those budget players. Um, like I said, you just need to be smart with your your picks and your purchases, in my opinion, and you should be good to go. But if I can find uh, Logan Thomas here, he's on the Cardinals. I can probably just search by the team. Um, but like I said, this is just a quick video I wanted to talk about. And you see, Logan Thomas is even cheaper. Uh, like I said, he's only a couple coins, and he's got 95 throw power. So if you're looking for someone with a little better throw power and a little better speed, a little more explosive, you can go Logan Thomas. His accuracy stats are not as good, but uh, he is you know, a very serviceable player. Uh, and so I really, really think that, guys, these are some of those players that not a whole lot of people talk much about, but these are the players that really make your squad, you know, what they are, these kind of cheaper players that you can buy so you can spend more coin on you know those other positions uh, or maybe save it for a, you know a nicer quarterback like I said Logan Thomas you know typically is about 200 coins 150 coin uh, and so it's really a really cheap card but in my opinion a really effective card um, you know like I said you can see it like across the board these these cards that don't really compare um, but anyway just want to kind of get that out want to show you some cheaper quarterback cards you can use uh, to be more effective in man the team so thanks for watching guys if you want to see more videos like this uh, just head over to the YouTube channel hit that subscribe button and uh, you guys will be notified whenever I post content I uh, hope you guys really appreciate all the Madden 16 content I've posted so far I will begin more on a regular schedule in the coming week but I just want to get everything out there as soon as I can and then we'll start with some of the series and things like that so